fellow walkers, Aristotelians, today the temperature is about uh, 50. Autumn day, the contemplative forest at Crockett Park outside Nashville, Tennessee. Today, I'm going to be talking about something that I've covered before, but I'm going to go deeper this time. And that is, what is joy and what is happiness? And it's important to know that because if they're confused, you will not know how to get one or the other. So let's define them in my world of biocognition as joy being the experience of your presence, the experience of your stillness, the experience of your essence. And you can have that anywhere, anytime, in the middle of a storm, in a mansion, in paradise, because it has nothing to do with externality. It has to do with the experience of you. You, without any attachments of uh, things you like, things you don't like, it's a stillness, an experience. Happiness is the things that are happening to you that give you pleasure, or the things that you have that give you pleasure, but they are not permanent because external things come and go. You are the common denominator. So get a new car, you like it. It gets old, you don't like it. You're in a good relationship, you like it. It's over, you don't like it. That's happiness. It's a pleasurable experience of external things happening to you or things that you like about you or about other people. But the awareness has to be that it is not permanent. In many cases, you don't have control over it. And that if you confuse it with joy, you will not be able to find joy because you'll look for joy outside of yourself. So knowing that, let's look at joy a little deeper. Joy is something that is within you and it requires your awareness and your focus on that stillness of yours. And what I mean by stillness is taking out all the noise, taking out all the who you are, what's going on with you, what you've accomplished, taking all of that and going into that essence of who you are as an experience of the now. And there's usually a stillness, it's usually something without specific meaning, more an experience rather than an interpretation. And when you do, and you go into it in a contemplative state or meditation or even walking around like I'm doing right now, you will find what I call the glimpses of joy, which is little, like little sparks that come out of uh, a sense of uh, belongingness, a sense of wellness, a sense of uh, forgiveness, a sense of emotional elegance, all the things that are clusters of the terrain of joy. So joy is a terrain filled with many, many things within you that can be found only if you go to your stillness. So now happiness, you can construct happiness by doing things that give you pleasure, being with people that give you pleasure, and having things that give you pleasure. But now knowing that, what happens then is that you're transforming an external event like happiness into something even greater if you experience it from the terrain of joy. So uh, happiness is icing on the cake the cake is your joy. So how to separate them? When you're feeling good, look at what it is that's making you feel good. 
that's happiness and try to enhance it and try to grow with it when you're not feeling good find out find out what it is externally that's making you not feel good and see if you can end it modify it or adjust to it now in both conditions what you do is you always go to your terrain of joy after you assess what's going on outside of you and then from your terrain of joy you create joy as your signal and everything else as your noise i've talked about it before the signal theory signal detection theory it's that what you're seeking as a radar is signal any interference is noise so when you want to go into joy what you do is you make your stillness your signal and any interference any disruption any blocks are your noise and you label it noise and you go to the signal of stillness once you're there then you can create from that place so the stillness is the portal that allows you to go into joy but it's also the portal that allows you to go in to create at a level that is very powerful and very sustainable so be aware joy is within you happiness is what happens around you so enjoy and see and joy means go into your stillness now i'll go back to mine and continue the happiness of walking within the terrain of joy <laughs>